what would you rather have in life? A cockroach crawling around you, or a ladybird, or ladybug, entering your room? The uh, horrible thing is, that window over there, it closes, but I can still hear everything, so I've been having ladybugs coming into my room. Can you believe it? There is a subway and a Starbucks in the one building. So they're over there, and this is my Asda nearby. I, I, I go here to do my shopping and stuff, you know. It's a good place. But the uh, thing is, if anybody wanting to move to England, shops close at 4 o'clock on Sundays. Today it's Monday, open to 10. So as you see, I've been in the shops, got myself a bag of Terry's chocolate oranges, uh, four bags of frozen vegetables that you just microwave for three minutes. Because I'm um, too lazy to do some cooking, I have a equipment in the house, like I've got a stove and an oven top, but I can't be bothered like cooking vegetables from scratch. And then also got my Redox shower gel. As I am slowly running out of shampoo samples. See, when I moved to Birmingham a few weeks ago, I just bought it about 25 samples of some sort of like hair care products and I started using them but I'm running out now after three weeks hmm so right now it's eight o'clock in Birmingham had my shower had my dinner got my sweet treats I gotta thank my cousin Lisa for recommending these because when I was visiting my cousin Lisa in northern Scotland she gave me some of these so, uh, my father in Australia, he lives out of Vinnie's, and so do I. I have been going to Vinnie's bookshops throughout this country, and you know, I'm always looking for anything with the name Jackie Collins. I just finished reading Lady Boss last week. I only started reading that book once I left Australia on the 7th of November. So it's taken me two months to finish that book. It's not because I'm a slow reader, it's because I don't tend to find the time to read these books. So, I mean, you gotta remember, romance novels, they're long, they're 500 pages, they're exciting, but you need to dedicate the time to read this. Like, I mean, like, like, this is Black Sabbath. I, I could read this within two days, and I could be done with it. But um, with romance books, even if they're written by both Colin's sisters, you got, it's best to take your time and read them. You just don't want to go. So, uh, the side thing is, um, Joan Collins should hopefully be doing another show in the UK this year. Or I might have to travel to go see her. She was in Australia last year, but to be honest, I didn't really become a fan until after I saw Absolutely Fabulous. Um, we all know Sally, Jackie Collins died in September. 19th 2015 like two months before my 30th birthday so I plan to get my US tourist visa in the coming weeks and get over to Los Angeles and pay my respects at a grave in Westwood because my mom's favorite author and now as a grown adult she's my favorite author but talking about authors and graves when I grew up I read a lot about Roald Dahl and now that I'm living in England, I might as well go pay a visit to his grave. It'd be worthwhile if I did it. Because, I mean, in this country, I've already visited Steve Clark, uh, John Bonham, and in Ireland, I visited Phil Leggett, plus all the other thousands of war graves I've visited. Good night, ladies and gentlemen.